I'm just a guy from Goodwill, Oklahoma, and I've got a really great video game idea. Hey everybody, Charles here, and we got the latest step on the Dark Monkey debug hunt. <laughs> Although, to be honest, I, I have just been totally grinding up against concrete the last few days. Uh, not really that, so much as that, like, I've just been playing the crap out of video games after staring, uh, you know, like, at my screen unenthusiastically. So, I finally got the information that I needed, and uh, it, oddly enough, uh, a lot of this grinding has been because I, I just have not had my Google skills up enough. But uh, I found out that uh, action registration, along with action ID, uh, I can just file it in there. Don't have to put it up with the menu. Don't have to put it up on any icon. It's just an action. And I just went in extended abstract action and rolled with it. So uh, this action performed here, uh, yeah, yeah, I do a runnable. Uh, really, the only thing that made this a runnable was this collator get instance statement right here. So that prevented it from, you know, just being fired right off the bat. Well, and of course, I would think that this try here would also do it. What? Oh, you're going to gripe at me? What? It's confusing indentation. Seriously. Uh, okay. Well, anyway, um... <laughs> Uh, this reminds me of that that one that one uh, commercial where the the guy from Office Space is like looking at the emails for the one chat room and he's like, "Ooh, look at it scroll, look at it scroll. It keeps indenting, it keeps indenting. Oh, look at that, isn't that nice?" But anyway, uh, that's beside the point. Anyway, uh, um, so I I've got a J file chooser. Uh, I thought I'd throw that in there so that I could uh, come out here. Uh, I've already done a couple of trials and I'm getting ready to do trial three so the trial three here is for the video uh, first trial I've got them all nicely alphabetically ordered and uh, that would be uh, thanks to you know I, I just did it on the tree set so that you know as this added them it would be in order so you know that's that's the beauty of tree set you can just automatically you know alphabetically <laughs> sort as you go and you don't have to do collections dot sort but although you know you could just do the collection dot sort after that's done, uh, but um, and then of course, uh, derp -a derp -a derp, we ah here we are. Uh, right here's where I pull up the J file chooser, and then here's where it writes. Uh, here's a null check, which this this uh, well I'll, I'll go ahead and play it here. The first one was alphabetical order. The second one was like, hey, there's this, um, oh, get string. Yes, NetBeans, you're, yes, I'm running you. I thought I could do this behind your little splash screen, but I guess I can't. There we are. Uh, and then trial two was where I found this, um, oh, UID fault. It was the uh, get string for key. And, of course, as you can see, I've got a lot of null, null, null. Oh, hey, here's something. Uh, so it ends up that it only prints strings, and so anyway, I did. I'm doing an object to string now, and let's see here. Oh, uh, for this action, all right, and I'll be posting this to GitHub. Uh, so I, I just I just called it display UI defaults, and I just categorized it under dark monkey, uh, and so that's what this bar is awesome for. And here's here's my little thing, and this one. I will go to my desktop and I will call this one trial three. All right, and save. Uh oh, there it popped up. Okay. All right, and uh, oh, what, what's really cool about this action is if you decide to cancel out, it'll just pump it to good old thing back here. Oh wait, we still got a lot of notes. Oh right, because I didn't put the new logic here as well. Okay, so yeah, there's the old behavior. This was what the old code, this new code, blah blah blah. And let's take a look at that, shall we? Alright, trial three. Oh, did I forget <laughs> I forgot to give it a TXT. Alright. Trial three. Uh-huh. Dot T X T. Yeah. All right. Okay. Oh, that is that is much better. Yes. Look at this. So we've got the good old two string. I mean, it's still giving me you know just memory address locations here, 
but at least I've got some classes going. So anyway, now I can uh, say, all right, so we know what's not working on this one. Okay, there was like a search bar down here. How did I pull up search again? Wow. Oh my gosh. I forgot how to do a search. Mid video, and I forgot how to do a search. Find? Find? No. Refit. Show. Um, where's the find? Find? Yes. Okay. So yeah, this is this is obviously what's not working. You know what? I'm gonna. This is trial four. Oh right, desktop, desktop, trial four. Dot txt. All right, and then I'm gonna go options. Uh, wait. Man, there's so much I've forgotten. There, here we are. Okay, so we've got default. Oh, let's flip it over to Nimbus. No, no, it was metal because this is based off of metal. So, you start. I guess I can close these while that one's loading. Where's trial four? There's trial four. Oh, son of a... Let go. Okay. All right, so here we are in metal. And do the whole... I guess it was control F. Yes, yes, and there it is working properly. With a grid bag layout. No, I don't. I mean, yeah, I'll eventually need to, but anyway, uh, display UI defaults. All right, and. <laughs> All right, and we'll call this one trial five. Dot txt. I so could have, like, added some stuff, but it's, it's not like it's going to be end user. Okay. So there's trial five, and you know I'll be able to. Uh, yep. Okay, so I'm gonna review this stuff, and you know I, I've been looking at it, and I'm like, duh, duh. But I know that uh, somewhere in the difference, I'll be able to to find. Hopefully, where that that search box is and why it's it's messing up on my stuff. Oh, wow! There's more stuff to look at. Okay. Uh, I guess that's it for now. Yeah. Um, <laughs> there's metal.